Hello guys welcome back to my channel so now today we are going to see degraining and regraining procedure in new so here there is our original plate and i have removed these two window here so here first we will see how we can remove grain or noise from our food then how we can reapply grain or noise on our final composting here so now here in new so this is our original plate and i have removed these two window with the help of clean plate here and this is our final output here and select this one and press one here so this is our final output here so if you will see here actually i have done everything here except degraining and regraining in nuke so here first if you will see this is our original footage then first thing because here just i have removed these two window with the help of clean plate so first thing how we can create our clean plate so here if you will see I have create clean plate in new so just select this one this roto paint node and press one here so here just I have removed these two window with the help of this roto paint here or whatever procedure you are using for creating a clean plate in new second thing if you want you can also import your clean plate so select this one and press one here so both are same but this clean plate just I have created in Photoshop select this one and press one here so after getting your clean plate first we have to use D noise node and just we have to remove noise or grain from our clean plate or from our footage if you are creating clean plate in new so here i have used this D noise node here for removing grains or noise from our this clean plate here so this is our original footage even if you have clean plate then direct you can connect D noise node with your clean plate here but remember this thing first you have to degrain your clean plate or just you have to remove noise from your clean plate this is important for further procedure here so here just i am going to explain how you can remove noise from your footage so this is our original footage select this one and press one here so now you can see just take a denoise node then press tab and just type denoise here so just connect this denoise node with your original footage and if you have clean plate then you can also connect with your clean plate now select this one press one here and after the just we have to pick a sample noise sample for removing noise here so this box you will see here then just simply select and just move it anywhere according to your footage and according to your requirement okay so here just i have placed it here so now select again this one and press d here so now you can see here so here i have removed all my grains or noise from our this footage here and if you want to adjust little bit this d noise amount then right side you will get this d noise parameters so this thing you will get so this thing just you can adjust according to your footage because if you will uh, see here this d noise amount which is by default actually one so this will actually little bit just reduce your texture details so if you want you can just a little bit decrease according to your requirement so this will remove your noise but preserve your all texture details here so this is uh, just mostly we will adjust for chroma removal so suppose if you are degraining chroma plate then you can adjust but for this footage one is sufficient then same as if you have clean plate then you can use this one control c control v just paste it here and you can connect with source so now you can see here and select this one and press one so now you can see here so with whatever procedure you have created your clean plate then after this we have to denoise our clean plate here so here you can see here so now select this one and just delete this one then after this i have used this clean plate then here just i have done just simple composting and i have removed these two windows from our original plate here so if you will see this is our original plate here and after composting i have got this result here this one because just we have to remove these two window here so just i got these two window with our this composting after this just i have composed this composting or this clean plate on top of our this original plate here so you can see here and i got this result here now again i have created a clean plate on 20 frame so you can see here on this 20 frame here so with whatever procedure you have composed your clean plate on top of your original food this is doesn't matter but after this what we have to do so this is important things here first just we have to degrain and just we have to remove grain from our clean plate then after composting just we have to 
check our final output so remember this one this one just i have got output from our this clean pad and this is our final composting here now just we have to check here all grains so actually you are not getting grains here here you are getting grains but here there there are actually no grains here so here we have to to match both grains here so this procedure actually is called regraining in new so here just we have to match these both grains here so this is important for composting here so now how you can match all these things here so again just come here in our this final composting here so this is our clean plate output whatever just i am getting after composting here so this thing here so here so after this just we have to apply regrains here for matching grains on our this final composting here so for this first i am going to use grain node here for regraining our this footage or this clean plate here so after composting just i am going to use it here so just press tab button and just type grain here this one and just attach after this composting so now just connect it here so now you can see here these grains so now just we have to match this and this grain so right side you will get some parameters here first preset so if you want you can also select different presets according to your requirements so this is size size of your grain then irregularity and intensity so all these values just we have to adjust and we have to match here so just we have to match channel by channels means first we will just match grain in red channel then blue then green so like this we can easily match all these grains here so now first just i am going to match this thing in our this red channel now press r here so now you can see here so this is our actually original plate here with grains and this one just i have applied grains here so now just we have to adjust this red value because just here we are inside our this red channels here okay so now just we have to little bit reduce size so this size just according to your requirement or according to your footage just you have to adjust so just little bit reduce, reduce it here then irregularity so just if you want you can adjust this one so maybe and this intensity is important because this is actually power of grains how much this will be visible here so just this thing just we have to adjust it here so according to this just we have to match it so maybe even size if you want you can little bit increase it so these values just we have to adjust it then green channel so now we have to match all these things in green channels also then after this in blue channel so in blue channel you will get these more grains here so now just we have to adjust these values in blue channels also so so now again press r g b so just individual channels just you have to match it here and so remaining the value you can adjust according to your footage and according to your requirement now just a little bit play and check here so now we are inside our this rgv mode here now just play and check here so just only this portion just i am going to play so here easily we can focus now you can see here so now if you will see here so here just i have matched these two grains with the help of this grain node so remaining value you can adjust according to your requirements press f here now you can see with the help of this grain node you can apply your grains on our final composting and now second thing just i am going to see how we can extract these grains and finally we can apply these grains on top of this clean plate or this composting here so just select this one control shift x so exit this node now again if you will see here there are no any grains here so easily you can see here so now just i am going to extract these grains so whatever just footage has grains so first we will extract this one then we will apply these grains on top of this composting here so for this just again we have to come here this is our original plate so select this one press one here then after this what we have to do just we have to take same d noise node here so just control c and just control v here copy paste and again just connect with our this original footage so now i have selected this one now press one here so double click here in this t noise so in output mode we have to select this noise so now if you will see here so here just i am getting only this noise here so you can see here this noise so after getting this noise just we have to apply this noise on top of this composting here 
this one here then easily we can match here so how we can apply so just simply just keep it here so what we have to do just select this one and press one here so this is our actually file output and this thing just we have to match it here so for this just take a merge node press m and just connect it here and this noise just we have to connect with our this a input in our this merge double click here in operation just we have to use plus now again just play and see so now you can also see here some noise or grains are here so here just we are getting our grains here but if you will see here actually here just we are getting some problems here select this one and just press one here so actually if you will see here so with this composting i am getting grain on top of our this clean plate here or on top of our this composting here but here also i am getting so while you will compose this output on our this original plate here and you will get this output so here you will get double grains means original footage also have grains and this grains also you are going to reapply on top of this footage also so you can see here so what we have to do so here just we have to remove all these grains in our this black area so because just we have to apply our grains on top of this composting not here also so now just double click here in this our this merge node so in this mass input just we have to use this rgb plus alpha because if you will see here now press one here now press a here so here just i am getting alpha here okay so now again press a here so just double click here so in mask input just simply select rgb plus alpha so now if you will see here we are getting grains only top of this composting here or on top of this clean plate here now just play and check here so now you can see and if you want to compare so just disable press d so now you can see so this is without grain here and this is our actually reapplying grains here so now if you will check this final composting so now this is looking good here and if you will not use this one so this will actually use your footage grains and also this will apply this grain on top of this footage so here you will get double grain here okay so this is important things here remember this one now just finally play and check here so this one so now if you will see here this is looking good here if you want to again compare then select this one and press d here so easily you can compare now you can see okay so these are looking good here so like this you can also first extract your grains then you can apply these grains on top of final composting here so here just i have explained two methods with the help of this grain node you can also match your grains in this grain node you can manage all these values and you can match according to your footage and with the help of this procedure you can also extract grains and finally you can apply these grains on top of composting here so till here whatever procedure you like you can use and just you can match your grains so if you like this video please watch share comment and subscribe my channel if you are still not subscribe my channel